Hey guys, so today we're starting in the Deep Della X position. One thing I always like to keep in mind when I'm in Deep Della X is that my butt is on the outside of my partner's foot. That way here I have enough leverage to pull him in and enough leverage to break his posture as well. So from here, I'm taking my right hand with the collar grip and I'm breaking his posture down. Now with my left hand, since, since I have a tightly locked Deep Della X, I actually do not need to grab a pant or an ankle grip like you would in a traditional Della Hiva guard. What I'm going to do is take my left hand and I'm going to go under my opponent's leg, not under my leg, just under his leg. And I'm going to use my right hand to feed the collar grip to my left hand, as you can see here. Now say Dave or your opponent is being super adamant in not letting you sweep them, not letting you break your posture. They can be kind of frustrating from here. What you can do in this position is you can actually let go of your deep Della X hook by taking your right leg out and using it to push on his knee, just like this, right? And I'm using my left leg to post on the mat. My left leg and my right hand are posting on the mat. This gives me good base to start coming up into a single leg. So while my right leg is pushing on his knee to stretch his base out, now I'm going to retract my right leg and scoop his right leg in this motion right here. This will allow him, his base is even more stretched out and he's not really in a good position to defend from here. I like to take my right hand, there's several ways to finish this single leg. I like to take my right hand, cup the back of my partner's head and pull them in right here. And again, we enter into a side smash position, just like this, where I can get a cross face, I can grab his bottom leg and I can start passing. 